Welcome once again, uh, uh, gent folks. Uh, thank you for joining me for another video for your Syria uh, betting tips and predictions. I uh, hope you're having a wonderful game week so far. And this year, game week that we're going to do with is going to start on Saturday through uh, the Monday. As you can see up here, this is the present game week, but this one is the following game week, which starts on Saturday because of the World Cup and uh, the holidays. Then games are, are, are the game weeks are, are kind of flowing into each other. You, you so maybe in another couple of weeks again we go back to, to, to normal like when you have uh, games being played on friday sunday saturday and monday rather than you having games being played on tuesday wednesday thursday and then saturday sunday again yeah uh so the schedule is a little bit crammed and the champions league is also coming up next month yeah but anyways uh so we have betting tips and predictions we're going to jump straight into it and we're going to start here on saturday with florentina versus osasuna and for Florentino versus Osasuna, I'm expecting Florentino to take your business here. And I'm expecting both teams to score as well. In terms of a double chance, I go with either to win and both to score. Predicted scoreline for me, I'm saying here, I'm expecting uh, Florentino to win this one. 2-1, uh, 3-1 one. One rather, sorry. Uh, otherwise, I guess they could win 2-1 today. <laughs> yeah, as I was sure, no 2-1, yeah. In terms of the handicap system, I'm going to go ahead and take Florentino to win this one by a goal. All right. The recap and predictions for Florentino versus Sosualo. I'm expecting Florentino to win here. Um, in terms of both teams scoring, I'm saying yes, that should be the case. Uh, in terms of a double chance, I'll go with either team to win and both to score. Uh, predicted scoreline 3-1 in favor of Florentino, I do believe. And in terms of the handicap system, I'm going to go ahead and take Florentino to win this one by a goal. Alright, so moving on to our next game here on Saturday. And our next game will be uh, Juventus versus Udinese. Uh, the Nice has started the season well, but they have been falling off. Uh, Juventus is at home, so I'm expecting Juventus to take your business. So Juventus to win. Uh, both teams to score, yes. Uh, in terms of uh, double chance, you go with either to win and both to score, yeah. Uh, predicted scoreline, I'm saying here, 3 1 here in favor of Juventus. Uh, in terms of the handicap system, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take Juventus to win by a goal. I know that's 3 dollars and 10. Yeah. Mm hmm. Way better than an outright win, yeah. Alright, then predictions for Juventus versus the Nisi. I'm expecting Juventus to win here. I'm expecting both teams to score as well. In terms of a double chance, I'd say either to win and both to score. Predicted scoreline 3 1 in favor of Juventus. And in terms of uh, the handicap system, I'm going ahead and taking Juventus to win this one here by a goal. Alright, so uh, on to the next game, as we say. And uh, the next game is Monza versus Inter Milan. And for the Monza versus Inter Milan, no, I'm expecting here, uh, I'm expecting Inter Milan to win, but it's not going to be easy for them. Monza, Monza is going to challenge them, I do believe, and I'm going to say both teams will score. Uh, in terms of uh, double chance, I go with either to win and both to score. Predicted scoreline for me, I'm saying, hey, uh, Inter Milan should win this one 3-1. One. In terms of the handicap system, I'm going to go ahead and take Inter Milan to win this one by a goal. 2050 to do so. To recap and predictions for the Monza versus Inter Milan, I'm expecting Inter Milan to win. Expecting both teams to score as well. In terms of a double chance, I'd say either team to win and both to score. Uh, predicted scoreline 3 1 in favor of Inter Milan, I do believe. Uh, Inter Milan on the handicap system, I'm taking them here to win by a goal, as you can see, and that's 2050 in terms of the odds. Really good odds, yeah. So those are my predictions for Monza versus Inter Milan, and now we're going to move on to our next game, and our next game will be. Uh, Sarenitana versus Torino and for Sarenitana versus Torino, I'm uh, expecting this one to be a, a good one. I'm going to give Torino the win here. I do the, the, they have the tools, but they have to be careful of Sarenitana. Sarenitana could surprise them, and so therefore they have to be very careful. Both teams to score, I do believe. And in terms of uh, a double chance, I go with either to win and both to score, yeah. Uh, Predict score line 2 1 in favor of Torino. And in terms of the handicap system, uh, or to go there, I would uh, go ahead and take Torino to win by a goal, but based on my predicted scoreline, I'm going to have to take a draw, yeah? In terms of another double chance, you could always go ahead and you could take uh, either team to win on under 3.5 goals in total for the game as well. Recap and predictions for uh, Sardinitana. Sardinitana versus Torino. I'm expecting Torino to win. Expecting both teams to score as well. In terms of a double chance, I'd say either to win and both to score. Uh, predicted scoreline 2-0 and 2-1 in favor of Torino. 
and the handicap system going ahead and i'm going to take a draw on the handicap system here uh, and the three-way handicap system based on my predicted score line and in terms of another double chance bet here i'm going here with uh, either team to win and on the 3.5 goals in total for this game right so uh those are my predictions for salentana versus torini and now we're going to move on to uh, lazio versus empoli and for lazio versus empoli um expecting uh this one to be a good one too i'm going to give lazio the victory here expecting them to win both teams down to score in terms of a uh, double chance i'll go with either to win and both not to score lazio for me should take this one two nil otherwise i think about three nil but i'm again i'm saying two nil at the moment here lazio on, they're on the comeback i do well they should be on the comeback because they've been they had a uh, full year last year uh they perform below par for the most part yeah uh, in terms of a double chance, you can go with either to win and under 4.5 goals. Uh, in terms of the handicap system, I'll go ahead and I'll take Lazio to win this one by a goal. Alright, so recapping predictions for Lazio versus Empoli. I'm expecting Lazio to win, expecting both teams not to score. In terms of a double chance, I'd say either team to win and both not to score. Predicted score line 2 0 in favor of Lazio, I believe. Uh, Another double chance here, Lazio or Empoli to win and under 4.5 goals in total for the game. Uh, yes, uh, so that's $1.53 if that does happen. And on the handicap system, I'm taking Lazio here to win this one by a goal and that's $2.40. Yeah, so those are my predictions for Lazio versus Empoli. Now we're going to move on to uh, Spezia versus Leash. And for Spezia versus Leash, yeah, I'm expecting this one to be a, a really good one here. Yeah? Spezia versus Leach is going to be a good game, I do believe. And for this one, I think it's going to end in a draw. Uh, scoring draw, that is both teams to score. Uh, the score should be one all. Uh, in terms of uh, double chance, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to say a draw on under 3.5. And so now we're going to head to the recap. Recap in Spezia versus Leach. Uh, Leash, I'm expecting this game to end in a draw. Uh, I'm expecting both teams to score. Predicted score line one all, I do believe. And in terms of a double chance, you could go with draw and under 3.5 goals for this game, yeah. And so those are my predictions for Spezia versus Leach game. And now we're going to move to Sampdoria versus Napoli. In the Sampdoria versus Napoli, I'm expecting Napoli to continue on a good way. Napoli to win here. Uh, both teams to score. Predicted. Uh, Double chance here, yeah, a double chance bet here, I should say. Uh, either team to win and both to score. For me, I am have Napoli to win this 1-3-1. One, one. On the handicap system, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take Napoli to win this one by a goal as well. So Napoli to win by a goal, $2.10. Alright, so recapping predictions for Sampdoria versus Napoli. I'm expecting Napoli to win. Uh, expecting both teams to score as well. In terms of a double chance, I'd say either to win and both to score. Predicted scoreline, 3-1 in favor of Napoli. And in terms of the handicap system, I'm going ahead and taking Napoli to win this one by a goal as well. Yeah? Alright then, so now we're going to move on to the next game. And the next game will be uh, AC Milan versus Roma. Wow, and this one is going to be very nice and interesting, I do believe. AC, Roman, AC Milan versus Roma, AC Milan defending champions, Roma with Jose Mourinho and Mourinho is, is usually a good tactician and so therefore this one is going to be a, a very challenging and interesting one I do believe and so therefore I think this is going to be anybody's game in a sense and so therefore both teams they're, they're going to have to be well prepared so I'm going to say both teams to score for starters both teams to score and uh, me i'm going to go with uh, this double chance here either to win and both to score predicted score line i'm going with uh ac milan to win 2-1 in terms of the handicap system go ahead and take ac milan to win by a goal but we're gonna have to take a draw here based on my predicted score line mm -hmm. so uh in terms of another double chance, you can go with either team to win and under 4.5 total in the game. Alright, so recapping predictions for AC Milan versus Roma. I am taking, I'm saying both teams to score here. And I am also saying here, uh, in terms of a double chance, I go with either team to win and both to score. Predicted scoreline 2 1 in favor of AC Milan. So I have AC Milan winning this game. And in terms of the 
handicap system uh, on the three-way handicap system we're gonna have the key draw based on my predicted score line here and also another double chance i'm gonna say either teams win on under three point under 4.5 goals in total for this game yeah getting dollar and 55 for that bet yes so those are my predictions for ac milan versus roma and so we're going to move on to the next game and the next game will be Hellas Verona versus Cremonese and for Hellas Verona versus Cremonese I'm taking Hellas Verona to win this game and both teams not to score in terms of a double chance I go with either team to win and both not to score predicted scoreline I'm saying here Verona wins this one 2-0 uh, in terms of the handicap system I'm gonna go ahead and take Verona to win this one by a goal alright so recapping predictions, Hellas Verona versus Cremonese, I'm expecting Verona to win, expecting both teams not to score. In terms of a double chance, I'd say either to win and both not to score. Predicted scoreline 2-0 in favor of Verona, I do believe. And in terms of uh, the handicap system, I'm going to go ahead and take Verona to win this one by a goal as well. Alright, so uh, let's move on to the next game. And this game here is going to be our final game for this game week. And this is Bologna versus atalanta and for bologna versus atalanta uh this one now um atalanta to handle business and uh, both teams to score i do believe huh? i'm gonna say either to win and both to score predicted score line for me i'm saying here uh atalanta wins this one two one in terms of uh the handicap system go with atalanta to win by a goal but we're gonna have to take a draw based on my predicted score line yeah so, uh, recapping predictions for Bologna versus Atalanta. I'm expecting Bologna. I'm expecting Atalanta to win. Who does? Yeah, if they do so. And in terms of uh, both teams scoring, I'm expecting both to score, and that's a dollar and seventy. In terms of a double chance, I'm saying either to win and both to score. And in terms of my predicted score line here, I'm saying Atalanta to win this one to one. Uh, otherwise, it might be three one or two nil. Uh, on the handicap system, I'm going ahead and I'm going to have to take a draw based on my predicted score line here all right so uh those were the predictions for bologna versus atalanta and that's how the cookie crumbles for this year week on your syria a betting tips and predictions i hope you took your notes uh, throughout this video you can always go back and replay the video and to, to get some further notes yeah uh, thank you for watching remember to subscribe to my channel uh and click the notification bell whenever you do so remember to spread the word about the channel as well and thank you for your support and we're hoping to grow bigger and better this year all right then thank you very much for everything and have a great weekend and happy betting